Hello, boys and girls. It's when we feel like it o'clock. I'm Pearl of Wisdom, and you're listening to my NHL Pearls of Wisdom in conjunction with BPAL Picks, which we're going to give you two free NHL picks today. And uh, this is Curtis Davis. Curtis Davis and I have known each other for quite a while, going back and forth. Uh, before we were, I was doing picks with another fellow here on Patreon that I have. And that fellow left, and uh, I, I I liked his, I liked Curtis so much I, I reached out to him and he, he said he was interested in joining me and while well, we've been doing very well since uh, you came on, um, hitting parlays a lot, hitting picks quite a bit, um, we're hitting about seventy five percent. You had a good you had a better day than I put out on Patreon today, didn't you? You went like seven and three. We did, and you know what I hate. We actually gave a parlay out uh, on uh, our show last night of three games take the puck line plus one and a half, and they hit, and I forgot to play it. <laughs> yeah, go check out our last video. We did give you a parlay that you could have played and hit. Uh, we also hit quite a bit on that one, too. Uh, we had Montreal. We had the over on that. Um, but we it seems i've been getting comments where people wanted us to be a little more straightforward and straight to the point with our picks so we're going to try doing that today we're going to give you two very good picks that are going to be go pro, we're going to pro, probably given to our clients uh i'm not saying there are top picks but i like them i'd bet them for sure i bet curtis is go, i'm sure curtis is going to bet these two picks we're going to give right curtis uh, yes, yes sir. sir. So we're going to bet them. You can depend on them. Uh, we're going to talk about two games today. Um, but first, we'll talk about a little bit. Could just go over quickly what you what you hit yes, last night. Yeah, I mean, we talked about it. Uh, Tampa Bay and over hit. Um, uh, we lost out on Washington. That was uh, one of my few losses. But we hit the over on that game. Uh, we hit... Uh, uh, Montreal and over, uh, uh, that was my best pick. Uh, I think we gave out yesterday, uh, if I'm mistaken. Uh, we said the New York Rangers definitely on the puck line. We said the over on the game. It didn't go there. and uh, um, But we didn't have goalie confirmation either. And uh, uh, the goalie I like was in there. So, uh, And then you like the New York Rangers goalie. So uh, I should have leaned the other on that. But, uh, you yeah, know, that's all right. Uh, um those are the only two straight picks I lost. Uh, and then uh, uh, we both leaned Cal, uh, but we both said Winnipeg plus one and a half. And um, uh, I think we leaned the over on that, if I'm not mistaken. Or I think we leaned an under when it was six and a half. It dropped to six, and I wound up taking the over, um, so it wound up hitting. Um, for, uh, for the Patreon, I put in four picks. I actually went f f uh, two for two. Uh, I went two, two, I got, uh, or sorry, yeah, four picks. I actually went 50%. And uh, I had a killer parlay of uh, the Rangers ML, uh, oh, well, we, oh, the Tampa Bay PL, which came in. And Washington was up 3 nothing, and I had Washington ML paid nice 10 banger, and then Boston came back and won. <laughs> So uh, it was still a wash day, no big deal. We're up. And that blew me up that they even covered the puck line because uh, uh, I thought, oh, I'm still going to hit that puck line. Yeah, but that's okay. So we're going to go. Uh, uh, I'm going to lean heavily on your picks, Curtis. A little more conversation before right. I put picks into the Patreon, but it wasn't too bad. It's just uh, that happens sometimes. Team was up. I still say it was the right pick. But it just didn't come in. Um, so tomorrow, we're going to go look at two picks. And the first one we're looking at is Carolina and Chicago, right? And that's on, the, we're looking at the, the money line. Or no, uh, we're looking at the spread on that. No, we're looking, what are we looking at? Oh, yeah, we're looking at um, the money line, but in regulation. What, do you, what are we looking at with that pick, sir? Yeah, I, I, I love Carolina. Um, I mean, they're they're five and zero in the series. Uh, they're four and one at Chicago. 
Um, Chicago's just in no shape and form. Uh, uh, they can't match Carolina right now. Um, Carolina's uh, looking awfully good. Yeah, they sure are. They were. I think they played Dallas last, and uh, was wasn't it? Was it Dallas they played yeah, last? And they played them very well. They beat them two games in a row. That's hard to do against Dallas. Uh, they had the only thing is is Mrazek is hurt, I believe. So Reimer will be in net. I, I'm a little concerned about that Lankening kid for Chicago. Um, but Carolina just has so much firepower. I'm sure they're going to get through to him eventually. And they're playing so well at both ends of the ice. I think Chicago is going to struggle getting enough chances for. Uh, I've, you know, Kane's about their only offensive weapon, in it, and if uh, Carolina can bundle him up, then uh, uh, I can't see where Chicago can uh, uh, equal the uh, firepower that uh, Carolina has. Well, they got Kubalik and um, uh, Strom, and you know, they they got some guys that can score, and they have a good system, and their coach yeah. is really good. I love their coach. They're putting out a full effort every night, so Carolina's going to definitely have to be on their game. Uh, oh, yes. Yeah. They can't take them for granted. And uh, like it's, I think we mentioned a few videos ago that uh, um, uh, that kid's going to be the future of the Chicago goalie yeah. uh, for a while. Yeah, Lankin, it looks like he's going to be, be a humdinger there. Yep. So, yeah, so the pick is Carolina – on the puck line, we don't have the, or sorry, not on the puck line, in regulation. Uh, the line on that is one in Canadian numbers. You can tell them in American. Canadian, I got about 156. So in reg is going to be about 180. Uh, what would that be, American? Uh, Guessing. It'd probably be about one. And I don't get regulation until a couple hours before the games start um, on my site that I, that I normally use. Um, and I didn't bother look up any of the other sites. I just looked on the site that I use. Um, you know, the money line is uh, 185, which is a little too pricey for me for a, an away team. And that um, I would not risk uh, that as a straight bet. Uh, I would tie that into a play or, like we said, uh, go with the regulation to cut down on the juice. Right. I could consider that game in a parlay money line for sure. Those are pretty good odds to parlay into something. But I think basically 100 bucks will get you 85 So that's not a bad, not bad juice on a game that I'm pretty sure about. So I like that pick for sure. Uh, the next game we're going to is the uh, Edmonton Oilers and the Ottawa Senators. And uh, we're playing a line on this one, aren't we? Uh, we're playing the side or total? Oh, we're playing the side. We're no, giving the side on this one. We're giving the side out? All right. Uh, yeah, I mean... Especially after watching the game the other night, I mean, how can you not take Edmonton? Um, Ottawa is actually uh, uh, the trends all lean toward them, but uh, that was a different time, different goalies, and uh, um, I don't see it right now. Uh, Edmonton's just ten times better. Yeah, Ottawa didn't really have any answer. Now the, they had Murray in that. I don't know if they're going to try to go back to Murray. But for our sake, I hope they do because that guy is just an absolute disaster right now. Uh, and that's really why the trends just get thrown out the window. Murray looks terrible. Um, I, I really like this pick. I'm, I'm, Edmonton on the puck line would be my pick on here, right? Yes. And um, uh, you may even want to look at regulation if you don't want to risk uh, – um, the, the puck line, you may want to uh, look at regulation. Yeah, regulation will still pay you about the same as the uh, the uh, Carolina game. There may be a little less, maybe 175. But I like the puck line at 210. 
Um, especially if Murray is in net. If you, if Murray is in net, I, I definitely will take that. And I put some pretty yeah. big pearls on that game. What they scored 13 goals the other night, uh, which is a record high, I think. Uh, well, it's definitely the high for this year. I don't know. It's not the high. It's not a record in the NHL, but uh, it's uh, the highest game scoring game so far this year in the NHL. Yeah, that's yeah, well. First period, I, I had an over on that for the for our Patreon members, and they got it in the first period. <laughs> they got the over on that game. Once they put Skinner in net, now the Oilers are going to have a, a little more rested Koskinen in net here. So um, I still like the puck line on that, especially if Murray's in net. I just, I, I don't think Ottawa's going to be able to score quite as much, but um, I do think Edmonton can score just as much. On the power play, I believe they were four for five. They scored four goals on, on five power plays, the Edmonton Oilers, uh, that last game against Ottawa. Uh, Ottawa just had no answer in any way, shape, or form for anything Edmonton had to offer. So we're giving you some really good picks here. And uh, I hope you, and I, I thank you for your feedback there in the comment section. Please, in the comment section, I'd love to hear what your picks are. Give us some parlays down there. I'm thinking about starting a parlay challenge in our comment section. And whoever wins at the end of the month, we'll give you a free month of Patreon. So you can check it out for free. Sound like a plan? That sounds like a good idea. Uh, yeah, we'll give you a, if, if you put parlays down there, I, I'm going to say that right now. If you put parlays down there, I'll calculate everybody's parlays. And if you win, I'll give you a free month of Patreon. Uh, so you can check us out for free. Uh, Curtis, thanks again. Um, we'll go over. Those are two good picks. They're not our best, best picks. If you want those, you go over to Patreon. You can get our best picks. Uh, Curtis has lined up a few there. We've talked about them. We're really confident. Plus, you'll get our parlays that are hitting. I think we're hitting out of seven parlays. I hit. I think we're. I think I'm four for four for parlays. Like four, four wrong, four on. So you can just imagine the juice we're up on that. That's quite a bit. Parlay's like crazy over there. Um, have a great, that's our full 42. Have a great day, everybody. See you later, Curtis. See you tomorrow. We'll be back tomorrow, right? Yes, have sir. Have a great day. Lots of love to you. Yeah.